That's insanity. If you think that of me, then we should not be together and we should not work together. Okay. I'm going to tell you right now. If you think that, I don't, I don't want us to be together. Okay. So if you think that. Okay, sure. I agree. Which is why I'm about to tear it down with this suite. You don't, just because we're incompatible doesn't mean you have to try to destroy I my do. life. I do. Why? Because I built it for someone I thought was compatible with. You didn't build it for it. someone. You, we, I, you, I literally put in hours of streaming, all of my work, all of my... Like, I learned in the photo shoots. I've done the work, too. Yet. It's not like I'm just a uh, fucking... Well, now you're claiming credit for it. What do you mean I'm claiming credit for it? I've literally been the one streaming for all these years and doing the photo shoots. Like, what the fuck do you mean claiming credit? <laughs> and now he's texting me, wow, you did it this time, you ruined us. Really? I'm the one that ruined us? You literally told me you were going to kill my dogs and you expect me not to snap after you say you're going to ruin everything, you asshole? What do you mean, why? We were like, did you guys just talk about this bullshit? What do you mean, why? If you're going to fucking try to stab me in the back on my social media platforms, it deserves to be out there that you're the one fucking lying and being an asshole to me. What the fuck? I, I can't hear you. I can't hear you. I, I... Good. I don't care. I've been dealing with you being an asshole to me for years and just disappearing from stream for 12 hours at a time. A lot of times you're like, why you got, why you got, I have to make up bullshit because you don't want to tell people about the, the fact that you fucking asshole to me for so long. You just take me away from my stream and start arguing at me for 12 hours at a time. They told me we're gonna go 24, we're gonna go 48. Like, yeah, you fucking asshole. Like, I deal with so much shit from you. I have so many offers from better people in my DMs who would actually treat me better. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? It's like you don't even care. Like, the one person who fucking hates Amaranth is the one she decided to be with, and I made the most terrible decision of my life, and now you just, like, fucking want to ruin you, it? Why did you swap me? I didn't fucking. You're fucking full of shit! My fucking god. And that right there is what you would call abuse. That is what it looks like. If you've been keeping up with the Amaranth story and stuff, then you know like what's happened and stuff like that her husband had a uh, control over all of her accounts and stuff like that. And and just shit. I still have the list of like things are written down. Just like, I feel like I'm looking at someone's rap sheet. Alright, anyways. Mm. <sighs> I want to talk to you guys about the situation. I made some notes over the past two days. No, excuse me. <laughs> no, excuse me. No, excuse me. I think I'm gonna keep it on emote mode for now. So I don't get distracted. Um you though everyone who's been like super kind and supportive lately over the past few days I've had lots of people reach out to show concern that means a lot I didn't think that many people would give a shit to be honest it's kind of crazy I've had a lot of friends and family reach out and other creators even people who don't like me <laughs> Like, even haters are like, damn, I fucking hate Amaranth, but you know what? I hope she's okay. I'm like, that's so nice. It's crazy. It's been, it's 
been a wild ride. Yeah. Yeah. As you can see, doggos are safe. The big one is outside in case crazy people show up. That's good. Staring at shadows. Exactly. Like the park opens? Yeah. All those people on the side. Really amusing for the Halloween show? The contest? Whatever it is? No. Put a sub goal. Oh, I forgot about sub goal. I don't need one. It's fine. Do sub if you like horse streams. <laughs> sub if you don't need animals. <laughs> As long as he's not going to kill me. He's not going to kill you. <laughs> I can put it down too. Stop. Whoa. Spirit. Whoa. There you go. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, here we go. And as you can see, uh, it looks like she's doing better, you know, uh, day one, freaking, I just wanted to show a little bit of the clips and all that stuff, you know, like, I don't want to keep the video going too long, though, but, yeah, it was nice to see her with her horses and all that stuff, you know, um, pet, or, I shouldn't say petting them, you know, grooming them and stuff, taking care of them, I was actually just, I was watching her stream, I was a little curious, just like, what, like, 50,000 people that were in there too you know it was like a bunch of cloggers in there you know it was like hell everyone with their horse emotes and stuff it, it was really nice to see that she you know like she's doing better and stuff you know it just it's like freaking like odd well I wouldn't say odd though but it's just like it's kind of amazing how many people are supporting her and stuff like that and you know I guess it works out she had a, hell she was playing Overwatch and stuff Though, but I just wanted to put it in the horse stuff. I just wanted to show a little update of uh, how she's doing. It. 
it seems like she's a lot happier around like other people and stuff which is good and stuff like after something like that you need to surround yourself with like different people you know breakups can kind of separate you from friends or whatever stuff like that and she has to deal with like legal issues like freaking you know like this marriage like honestly do things like an annulment might be possible and stuff because like in some annulments and everything if like if you describe about how much abuse there was or something or there's some cases is like where it wasn't done in our church and stuff some people take the religious part like path and everything and you know just try to get it annulled that way and some people end up doing it and you know getting it that way um but you know it's like a that might be like the safer route maybe like maybe it's like the more i would say i want i want to say riskier or you know like hard to like a hard path to get through like with an annulment you know instead of a divorce and stuff like that though but i think if she gets a divorce and everything like if she has to and everything get a damn good lawyer so and it's good that she's doing better so all right, well, I hope you all liked this video. Just wanted to give a good update and stuff. Uh, hell, she'll probably update everyone. I just wanted to do a follow-up video. So, uh, again, man, if you or a loved one is going through abuse, uh, don't be afraid to reach out. You know, if you're being abused, don't be like, don't be afraid to ask. Like, are you okay? You know, it's like I think that like sometimes people just need to hear that question: Are you okay? Like, if, like, sometimes it can get a little annoying if you're actually okay and stuff. Like, you're just, like, you could, like, just be pissed off that, like, someone ripped you off a dollar. Like, man, I'm still pissed off at that guy. Which I think that, like, something like that, though. But it, it's always good to ask, are you okay? So, you know, reach out there. You never know. All right. Perfect. Hey, thanks for watching. Come hit that like and subscribe. Come take a look at the new merch shop and everything. Got some mugs. Get, come get yourself a t-shirt if you want. You know, just, hell, come join the Discord. Got a Facebook group. Come join me on Twitter. Everything that, uh, all of my socials are going to be in the description right below. So, uh, thanks for coming, man.